Little Richard. <laughs> Prince. <laughs> James Brown. Jackie Wilson. Dun, dun, dun. All right. Mm -mm. Hey, yeah. Oh, uh. Rick James. Oh, yeah. Where the drugs? Sean Hart. No, no, no. Sean Hart, the wrestler? No. He's Sean Hart. No. Oh, oh, Sean Hart. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, I'm gonna say HR because he's my favorite screamer. What? And that's it. In the order of perceived misogyny, if Little Richard is, to me, at the bottom, only because we don't know, you know, uh, how often he interacted with women and if it was a misogynist interaction. So we put him at the bottom. But then, Jackie Wilson also, you know, seemed very mild-mannered. And it was a time when we didn't, we didn't know everybody's business, you know what I'm saying? We didn't know what was going on behind the scenes. And Jackie Wilson didn't come up with any of those stories like the Sam Cooks of the world, so... We don't quite know exactly, I don't know, I should say, what Jackie Wilson was about. But then, Prince, I'd put him, put him third, which is a strange place to put Prince when I'm as big a Prince fan as I am. Because James Brown and Rick James are at the top of the list, misogyny. I'm, I'm going to have to, because James Brown was beating women. Uh, Rick James was, I'm sure, drugs, you know, had him beating women, and he had women dancing in, in, the, in the lingerie. I think I'm a, ooh, that's rough. I'm actually going to put James Brown at the top of the list. Maybe it'll be a Rick James Brown. That's what, Rick James Brown is at the top of the misogyny list. Yeah, so Rick James Brown, Prince, Jackie Wilson, Lil Richard. Mm-hmm, I think that would be my order. And then if I was to shout like them in a, in a misogynistic tone, Lil Richard. <laughs> yeah. yeah, right? Uh, Lil Richard would be like, what pop a loop up a what bamboo? You know, just you know. <laughs> yeah, is that is that funny to you? Okay. And then Jackie Wilson will be like, shoot. You know, just happy. There ain't nothing wrong with Jackie Wilson. Can, anyone got some dirt on Jackie Wilson that I don't know? No, but you know, I could look some up. Yeah, we'll look up dirt. We'll look up dirt during dessert. And then Prince, see Prince, he had that moment in Extra Lovable where he actually said a lyric, I'm on the verge of rape. I don't think you heard me. It's a, it's a poppy song. It's all like, I'm on the verge of rape. It's like, wait, what, what did that motherfucker just say? He, uh, okay. I don't think you heard me. I'm on the verge of rape. And then he breaks it down. The music slows down. He's like, I'm sorry. I'm just going to have to rape you now. Are you going to enjoy it or do I have to drag you in? So, based on that alone, and also the, the scantily clad women, Prince at number three on the misogyny list, uh, with a little bit of, of <laughs> no wait, I have to go back to the wind doves cry. <laughs> okay, that's not exactly, but you got me. Then let's see, the Rick James Brown. Hmm. All I can think of is a meow for Rick James, and then, and then, uh, <laughs> so, uh, oh, that's a good one. how, <laughs> Rick James Brown, yeah, no, all right, that's all I got for the moment, let's have some dessert.